So you want to leave that peanut butter all day just in case uh, someone does uh, happen to come encounter with you where you end up kissing them. They're like, wow, this guy tastes great. I want to stay with this guy. He's got these delicious peanut butter lips. Welcome back. We got a good one for you today, folks. So if you're like me, you just woke up bright and early, Sunday morning, 1 p.m., you want to get a productive day, dang out of you. Well, you need the right energy to do that, and I got that for you. Today we're making peanut butter and jelly smoothies. Clean gains, baby. You're going to feel great after you eat one of these. Probably take a massive shit to it. I usually poop within five minutes. Here's what you need. Blender. I use the, uh, the Ninja. This thing was uh, from Target, $20. Works better than any, any expensive blender you buy, I assure you. And it's super easy to clean up. You want an easy cleanup blender, because cleaning up sucks. Peanut butter. I prefer nutso. It's very liquidy, and it's just a blend of like a ton of nuts. All sorts of nuts. They got every nut in the world in this thing. Frozen bananas. You don't have to use them frozen, but frozen gives it a much better texture. I highly recommend frozen. How do you get frozen bananas? They don't sell frozen bananas at the store. I know. You gotta buy the bananas. Put them in the freezer yourself. Also, pro tip, you don't want to learn this the hard way, peel the bananas before freezing them. Do not just stick them in there in the peel. It's a mess, nightmare. Mixed berries. I like strawberries, blueberries, blackberries, raspberries. Those are the blends I use. You may like other berries, like uh, um, berry winkle. These are the berries I recommend. Cinnamon, I don't know why I put cinnamon in there. Wife told me cinnamon's good for me, so we put cinnamon in the smoothie. Himalayan pink salt. I think it's the same as regular salt, to be honest with you. I don't think there's any real difference in the salts. So any salt you have, you don't even have to use salt. Chia seeds. Once again, wife recommended. No idea what these do, but uh, we'll throw some in there. She seems to know what she's talking about. She's pretty healthy. Hemp seeds. These are for extra protein. It's for those gains, baby. You know what I'm talking about? And then a, uh, I use a nut milk. You can use regular milk also. Any type of milk, just as a liquid to blend this sucker up. I am using the uh, cashew milk. I like a real creamy, creamy smoothie. And uh, I'm trying not to eat milk right now. Just So, cashew milk. I highly recommend it. Now you've got all the ingredients. You know what the game plan is. We're going to throw this all in the blender, blend it up, and it's done. Cooked. Make sure the blade is inside your blender before you start putting the shit in there. Because if you fill this thing up, and then you put the blade in, Fudge. the blade doesn't fit anymore. Huge mistake, and I've made it like 20 times. I like to start with the banana. For a single serving smoothie, I use about half a banana. You could go more if you're trying to get more gains, but you know, I'm just trying to keep this tight body, super athletic look, you know? Then the berries, also frozen by the way. Frozen berries, they sell these frozen. You know, they don't sell bananas frozen, but they sell berries frozen. So I use all frozen because it's, you buy berries at the store, you get home, you look at them, they're moldy already. It's like fudge. Just get them frozen. Probably wondering how much I put in of uh, berries. I don't really know. I did a lot in this one. This is gonna be a big smoothie. We got a lot of blueberries, strawberries, Banana berries, blackberries, we got them all in there. Now we do the peanut butter. This part could get messy, be careful. If there's women and children in the room, have them stand back, because this sh gets everywhere. This amount, it's really up to you. I put a load of peanut butter, I like peanut butter. If you don't like peanut butter, you're gonna wanna go on the light side. Look at this heaping spoonful, just plopping in there. Look at that plop. Can we get a close up of that plop? Let me get a plop close up, please. Just a heaping plop. Fresh pile of. Okay, can we get a shot of that? You want to save this spoon. You're going to eat your smoothie with the spoon covered in peanut butter, and it's going to taste great. I call it the peanut butter spoon. Don't put this down on the counter. It'll make a freaking mess. We will get our smoothie cup. Today's smoothie cup is going to be the Pirate Skeleton Shark Cup. If you've got a Pirate Skeleton Shark Cup, I highly recommend eating a smoothie with the Pirate Skeleton Shark Cup. You just feel cooler, and then the smoothie tastes better. So we got the peanut butter, the bananas, the berries. Let's do some hemp, hemp, hemp seed hearts. 
Look at this, this is peanut butter protein, hemp seed heart protein. This is practically, this is a steroid smoothie, people. You're gonna be just juiced up after this. This is probably the secret that all the world champs use to win those um, big muscle competitions. I forget what they're called, but uh, you guys know what I'm talking about, the, the really big muscle competition kind of people, all the guys in it look like me, just beefy, juicy, fresh. Chia seeds. I have no exact measurements. Pour some in there. So I just kind of wing it. Start small on your first smoothie and you increase the amounts as you feel necessary. Here on the greatest cooking channel on YouTube, we wing it for everything. And you know what? Shit usually. 50% of the time, shit tastes good, you know? Throw some salt in there if you like salty stuff like myself. Cinnamon. I do a couple, uh, like, see, a, sp a splash like that. Maybe one, two, three splashes. Three splashes of cinnamon. That's a good amount. Nut milk. Or mi any milk for that matter. The amount you're gonna use depends on you. Do you want a thicker ice cream like smoothie or do you want a thinner liquidy smoothie? I like it liquidy. I wanna drink it. Um, even though I still eat it with a spoon, but I like it liquidy. You know, to each his own. All right, so there you have it. We've got frozen bananas, frozen berries, peanut butter, hemp hearts, chia seeds, cinnamon, cashew milk. I think that's everything. Let's blend this sucker up. It's gonna taste great. You're not gonna to wanna to miss any of it. So you grab your peanut butter spoon, pour this. I guess you could eat it straight out of the blender. You could eat it straight out of the blender, be less clean up. That's a pro move, but uh, I'm gonna eat it out of the skeleton cup because the skeleton cup looks cool, makes me feel cool, smoothie tastes better. Pour it all in there, look at that. Good. Cameraman, are you getting this? Whew. Oh yeah, get it all. You don't want to leave no berry left behind, not here on this cooking show. All right, throw all the shit in the sink and then it's time to enjoy your smoothie. What we have here is quick and easy clean games. Look at that. It's got your mouth watering, doesn't it? Oh, another masterpiece. Incredible. Just another great, another great meal. But you're only gonna find here on Cooking with Jeffrey. All right, thanks for watching. Enjoy your clean gains. If this video get, gets you gains, clean. Clean, clean games. Be sure to smash that subscribe button. Smash that like button. Drop a comment below. Say what's up. Mmm. Maybe send me a picture of you enjoying your smoothie. We could share it in the next video. Mmm. When you're eating a smoothie this good, you're just gonna wanna move. You feel good. You feel loose, these clean games, you can be able to accomplish whatever you want for the rest in the rest of your rest of your Sunday. So you get you get peanut butter buildup on your lips. So now if you go kiss anyone, you're gonna taste great. So you wanna leave that peanut butter all day just in case uh, someone does uh happen to come encounter with you where you end up kissing them. They're like, wow, this guy tastes great. I want to stay with this guy. He's got these delicious peanut butter lips. <laughs>